This is your time. This is your season. And this is your moment. I'm here to tell you that you are destined for greatness. What we're going to be talking about today is how bad do you want it? I'm telling you, you want to write these, you want to write these, you want to write these principles down. And this is a motivational video that is going to be extremely important. I want you to take notes and I want you to write this down. And I'm not just here to motivate you. I'm not just here to pump you up. I'm not just here to inspire you. But I am here to empower you. I'm here to make sure. This is what I'm doing. This is what I this is who I am as a motivational speaker. I'm here to make your life better. I'm your inspirator. I'm your motivator. I'm your life coach. I'm here to empower you. I'm here to make sure that you overcome everything that you're going through. I'm here to make sure that you become great. I'm here to make sure that you become successful. And I'm here to make sure that you accomplish your dreams. Yes. As a motivational speaker, I don't just care about the money. As a motivational speaker, I love you. I love the people. I love the people I speak to. And I'm getting messages, thousands of messages from people all over the world that are telling me that my motivational videos are changing their lives. I want to give a shout out to New Zealand, to England, Paris, Germany, Canada, Australia, Africa, uh... Uh, Mexico, all the places around the world that are reaching out to me. I give you a shout out. I'm here for you. G Germany, Paris, London. I'm here for you. And I want to tell you, you can do it. It is past possible. You can be so successful. Let me tell you how successful you can be. Let me tell you how possible it is for you to accomplish your dreams. Let me tell you how possible it is for you to go to the next level. It is literally past possible. It is past possible that you can win the Super Bowl. It is past possible that you can win the NBA championship. It is past possible that you can go do you, that you can win the NCAA basketball championship. It is past possible that you can win the NCAA football championship. It is past possible that you can that you can win the women's NCAA basketball championship. It is past possible that you can start your business. It is past possible that you can play Major League Baseball. It is past possible that you can become the CEO of that company. It is past possible that you can get through all of the pain, depression, the divorce, your sickness, cancer, your issues, your personal struggles. It is past possible. You can get past anything that you are going through. It is past possible. The mind is the limit. What are your dreams? I want you right now to visualize, to imagine, to get what you want to be, what you want to do, and what you want to become. Get it in your mind right now while you're listening to me, while you're watching this video. Let me tell you about me. I've already spoken in London in my mind. I've spoken in Canada in my mind. I've spoken in Australia in my mind. I've spoken in the NBA in my mind. I've spoken in the NFL in my mind. I've spoken in corporate in my mind. I've spoken in other places internationally in my mind. I have been there in my mind. I've rehearsed it in my mind. I've done it in my mind. And that's what I want you to do. Whatever you want to do, whatever you want to be, whatever you want to become, I want you to visualize it in your mind. The mind is the limit. Everything starts in the mind. How bad do you want it? I can, I will, I must. You got to be hungry. Beast mode, lion mode, blood, sweat, tears, 120%. Grinding, chasing, going, chasing the gazelle. You are the lion. Why? Because lions are wired differently. Lions are the king of the jungle. You want to be a lion. You want to be in hunt mode. You want to be in pursuit. You want to go after your dreams. You want to focus on the journey. You want to focus on the process. 
Because within the process, there's maturity. Within the process, you learn from your failures. Within the process, you learn from your mistakes. Within the process, you develop integrity. Within the process, you learn how to hone your craft. Within the process, you practice over and over and over again till you master your craft because your revenue your, you becoming a millionaire is in your gift, is in your purpose, is in whatever you were created to do, is where your revenue will be, is where your revenue will be coming from. You don't want to make a lot of money doing something you don't love to do, but you want to become a millionaire. You want to make a lot of money following your passion, doing what you love to do, and not just because you can make money. So many people, they've done things, so many people, people come to them and say, do this. And because you can make a lot of money if you do this, but that is, but is that your passion? Will you love doing that? Follow your passion, follow your heart, follow your gifting, do what you love to do. Michael Jordan loved to play basketball. Kobe Bryant loved to play basketball. LeBron James, Stephen Curry, Kevin Durant, Clay Thompson, Kawhi Leonard, Anthony Davis, Chris Paul, Giannis, James Harden, they, they love to play basketball. And because that's their gift, they make their money from what they love to do. So do what you love to do. I went from flunking the first grade to having a learning disability, having a reading and comprehension problem. I was bullied in school. I was picked on. I was told I would never amount to anything. I barely graduated high school. My high school teacher told me I wasn't smart enough to go to college. She said, Tommy, you're not going to graduate high school. See, she tried to put limitations on me based on what she saw me going through. And that's what, many pe that's what people are trying to do to you. They're trying to put limitations on you based on what you're going through. Then in 2009, how bad do you want it, Tommy? In 2009, I became homeless, living on the streets in 100 degree in 100 degree weather during the summer, begging for food. Could not shower, could not brush my teeth, had nowhere to lay my head. Then after that, I was shot multiple times. And when I got to the hospital, I was pronounced dead. It seemed like my life was over. And then I did get into college. But I flunked out of college, but I didn't give up. And then they let me back in college on academic probation. And then now years later, I got my bachelor's in six years, got my master's in five years, got my doctoral degree in a year and a half. And now years later, I am a motivational speaker speaking to you, changing your lives. This is my new book that just got published a week ago. Go to Amazon and type in, you are a winner. That's what I want to tell you. You are a winner. Type in, you are a winner. And type in, Dr. Tommy Camel Jr. And then this is my other book. Go to Amazon and type in, anything is possible. It is past possible. I never thought I would be an author. It is past possible. Type in, anything is possible. And type in, Dr. Tommy Camel Jr. And then this is my last book. Go to Amazon and type in Dream Big and type in Dr. Tommy Campbell Jr. Three books. Maybe you've been telling yourself you want to write a book. What are your dreams? How bad do you want it? Nothing in your life will start to go right until you get right. Woo! I'm going to say that again. Please write that down. Nothing in your life will start to go right until you get right. If you want to become a billionaire, if you want to become a multi-millionaire, if you want to start your business, if you want to win the Super Bowl, the NBA championship, the NCAA championship, if you want that academic scholarship, if you want to get that PhD, that doctoral degree, you want to go to medical school, you want to take the bar exam, you want to be a teacher, a movie producer, a singer, or a rapper, or a real estate investor, real estate owner, real estate estate agent, whatever you want to be, nothing in your life will start to go right until you get right. So if you want to accomplish your dreams, you're going to have to make changes and make decisions that will help you accomplish your dreams. Take, talk less. This is what I want you to do. Talk less and do more. Don't just talk about what you will do. But be a person of action. You, you know my story. How bad do you want it? How deep 
is your will. When you get sick, when you lose a loved one, whenever you face trouble, are you going to give up? Are you going to quit? Are you going to stop procrastinating? Or are you going to talk less and do more? Flowers. Flowers don't blossom quickly. Flowers need time to blossom. And you need time to blossom. Michael Jordan didn't become the greatest basketball player overnight. He was like a flower. He needed time. He had to blossom. He had to keep practicing. He got cut in high school. He had to keep practicing. He had to keep grinding. He had to keep working out, lifting weights, putting in overtime. And now he's the greatest basketball player of all time. Flowers need time to blossom and you need time to blossom. It is a process. Greatness does not have happen overnight. Success does not happen overnight. Nothing great happens instantly. Greatness takes time. Success takes time. How bad do you want it? I can. I will. I must. Someone said that your mind is your instrument. You must learn to be its master. Change the way you think. Stop being negative and become positive. Stop thinking average mind. Stop being, stop having an average mind and get a phenomenal mind. Think greatness. Think big. Don't think small minded. Think outside of the box. Get out of your comfort zone. Take off the limitations. Come out of your comfort zone. I'm closing. As I close, don't spend the rest of your life Living someone else's life. Woo! You want to be the best version of yourself. You want to be your authentic self. Don't spend the rest of your life living someone else's life. Be yourself. As I close, the right people will come into your life if you renew your mind. If you renew your mind, if you stop procrastinating, if you stop being negative and become positive, if you get a championship-like mentality, then the right people will come into your life. You want to connect with people who are greater than you. If you're around negative people, if you're around toxic people, if you're around people who are making you do the wrong things, they're pulling you down. You need to get out of those relationships and hang around people who are great. Hang around people who 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 you want to you want to ascend to their level. Hang around people who can help you get to the next level. You may say, "Well, I don't have the connections. I don't have the money. I don't have the resources." Don't make excuses. You can start from the bottom. I just this is what I did. I got in front of the camera. I've always been a gifted speaker, but I get in front of this camera and I speak like I'm speaking to thousands, like I'm getting paid thousands of dollars because I love what I do. I love you. I believe in you. I know you can do it. I know you can achieve it. I know you can. I know you will. I know you must. If you want to succeed as bad as you want to breathe, then I know you will become successful. Because I know you can't live without breathing. Without a... You cannot survive. Without... You cannot live. So you need breath in your body to sustain life. So when you want to succeed as bad as you want to breathe, then you will become successful. Your dreams will come true. Your dreams will become a reality. You can do it. You can achieve it. You can accomplish it. How bad do you want it? This is the question I want to ask you. How deep is your will? There are places that you're, that you're being smart can't take you. You being gifted, you being talented, you being athletic cannot take you. But when you have that will, when you have the heart, it can take you to a whole nother level. Because there are a lot of smart, gifted people, but they're not doing anything with their life. Because their will is not deep enough. How deep is your will? Please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Please spread the word about me all over social media as a motivational speaker. Please tell all of your family, your friends about me as a motivational speaker. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel. I need your support. I want to tell you I love you. I believe in you. 
You can do it. You can achieve it. And you can accomplish it. This is your time. This is your season. And this is your moment. Thank you.